Okay, the core of the heat factory line is our air activated hand warmers. The hand warmers are available in pairs, that's how they're generally packaged. Uh, they're packed 40 per box. Besides the 40 pack box, they're also available in a pack of 12 hand warmers, and this has been very successful for us. One of the great reasons for the success is that customers can just grab a bag and then go out for their ski trip, their hunting trip, whenever it happens to be. It just uh, makes it very convenient to always have them on hand. Uh, the air activated hand warmers will last 10 hours. Uh, they're one time use warmers. Uh, besides uh, working very, very well, they also have to be uh, very eco friendly. The, the ingredients in the hand warmers are iron powder, salt, vermiculite, and charcoal. Which is basically dirt, uh, so that once the um, they're used up, you can just cut open the packet, sprinkle it on the ground, and pack out the wrappers to be recycled. We also have a large 20-hour warmer. Uh, the 20-hour warmer is uh, can be used certainly in a pocket. And many, many years ago, this was the original size warmer. Even though we call it a large warmer now, uh, it's great for uh, putting it on our back wrap, keep the kidney war kidneys warm, and the rest of your body will stay warm. Uh, can be used in our stadium cushion. We only have a three-year shelf life. Our hand warmers do have an expiration date on the uh, on the packet. That doesn't mean that you know after three years they're going to stop stop working. Uh, I've I've actually opened warmer packets that are literally ten years old and they'll still stay warm for two or three hours. So you know after after the uh, say at four years or five years, rather than getting ten hours out of the uh, warmer, they might last eight hours or something along those lines. You know, they gradually won't last as long once they get past their expiration date. But uh, you know, three years from the date of manufacture, and hopefully you'll be outside and using them long before that time. Mm -hmm. I like the idea that it's made in the U.S. So I encourage people to turn over those heaters when you see them at the checkout stand, and uh, make sure you're getting the made in the U.S.A. Really appreciate your time.